Good afternoon, staff and students. I'm Dylan Jordan. And I'm Maggie Sullivan, and this is your Raider Report. If you're a member of the 2017 football homecoming court, there is halftime ceremony rehearsal today. This year, rehearsal will be held on the main football field and will begin right after school. 9th, 10th, and 11th grade escorts are not required to attend. Please see Ms. Tranzu with any questions. Junior Civitan International is an association of community service clubs founded in 1917. This is a student-led organization that aims to build good citizenship by providing a volunteer organization of clubs dedicated to serving individual and community needs. The international organization includes 40,000 members and almost 1,000 clubs around the world. Above all else, Junior Civitan members aim to follow the golden rule and we offer cords for our graduates. Our first meeting will be October 3rd in room 520 at 345. Please see Ms. Leggett for applications. Due to the inclement weather last week, the Animation Club's first meeting will be Tuesday, October 3rd at 345 to 415 in the cafeteria. That's the Tuesday after we return from fall break. See Mr. Hill in room 269 if you have any questions. The Equestrian Club meeting has been rescheduled for Friday, September 22nd at 745 a.m. in room 854. All those interested in forming our new club and potentially competing next school year should attend. Please see or email Ms. Archer for more information if needed. Are you interested in the law? Do you like to argue? Do you think you want to be a lawyer? Are you a drama queen or king? Then come join the NFHS mock trial team. We need pushy lawyers and wild and crazy witnesses to complete our team. Our case this year is a criminal case. Come join the fun of beating South, West, Central, Lambert, and maybe others. Meetings for now are at 7.45 a.m. in the Media Center on Wednesdays. The registration meeting for Swim and Dive will take place on Tuesday, October 3rd at 6 o'clock p.m. in the Media Center. Please see Coach Martin if you have any questions or cannot attend the meeting. Raider Chess Club meetings will now be held on Wednesdays in the Media Center. You don't have to be a member to show up and play. Are you interested in being in History Club or a Social Studies National Honor Society or OCAPA? Please come get an application outside of room 1101. Applications are due by Friday, October 13th to Miss Wood in room 1101. HOSA will be hosting its first blood drive October 3rd in the upper level of the Raider Arena. Please remember to bring a picture ID with you along with your pass. Make sure you eat a good breakfast and drink pl plenty of fluids. Get plenty of rest that night. It's not too late to sign up either. Please see Mr. Stallings, room 351, to register. The world appreciates your donation in this time of need. Parking lot party today, sponsored by Y Club. Festivities will begin in 881 immediately after school to give the bus lot time to clear out, and then the party will move outside. What should you expect? Games, food, giveaways, and tons of fun. There may or may not be water balloons involved. All students are invited to attend. The party will wrap up at 530. There will be a Drama Tech Club meeting after school today from 4 to 6 p.m. in the pack. Now we'll go to Lucy Malone with our upcoming Raider sports action. Tonight there will be a JV and varsity volleyball game in the Raider Arena against Milton High School. JV starts at 5 and varsity at 6. There will also be a varsity softball game on the Lady Raider field against Milton High School at 5.30. We will have a 9th grade football game at West Forsyth High School starting at 6. We will also have a JV football game in Raider Valley against West Forsyth High School starting at 6. Tomorrow, we will have a varsity softball game at Grayson High School starting at 7. Our varsity football team will be playing Woodstock High School in Raider Valley starting at 7.30. This is our homecoming game, so you want to make sure to be there or be square. That's all for Raider Report. Thank you for watching and have a great day.